46 of Flick, James Flick, your one and only movie reviewing secret agent. Today, I will be reviewing Rise of the Planet of the Apes, starring James Franco. Wow, so one of the lab chimps has been shot down after running amok. So will our main character, played by James Franco, has adopted a baby chimp named Caesar who has grown up over the years and displayed signs of high intelligence. That is pretty interesting, dude. Caesar, our main chimp, is being allowed to play in and explore the California Redwoods. That is pretty neat. Caesar just got himself into a car. Whoa! Caesar is now gone berserk and is now running amok. Animal control officers have now shown up and taken Caesar away. Caesar just got a pretty good hose down. Caesar is now being caged up with other apes of his kind. That electric spark sure got some of the apes going. We are now an hour into this movie and so far a new drug is being talked about that is supposedly a cure for Alzheimer's. Caesar has now brought together his fellow apes to join his, ca his cause of evolution revolution. Now we are seeing all the apes escaping from their cages and wreaking havoc. The humans are now discovering the aftermath of the cage break performed by apes. Look at all the damage the apes are doing to human-run facilities. All the apes have taken to the streets and are creating citywide chaos. San Francisco's Golden Gate Bridge is now looking like a war zone between apes and humans. Whoever thought that a gorilla could jump onto a moving helicopter like that? Will has taken a police car and is now bravely going after Caesar. As this movie draws to a close, Will has done some reconciliation with Caesar and the other apes. Overall, Rise of the Planet of the Apes is a great action-packed reboot of a classic sci-fi thriller franchise with excellent performance capture and amazing visual and special effects. Join me next time when I review Mission Impossible Rogue Nation. I'm Flick, James Flick, your one and only movie reviewing secret agent 